Okay, so this is about um, exporting the references in NVivo so that we can look at them for understanding the coding a little bit better. So I was trying to figure out how to get all this information out. I figured out how to export just the list of notes, but it was not pulling out my references. So I wanted to figure out how to use the references. The reports and extracts was not really giving me what I needed it to do. Maybe I did not uh, figure it out correctly, but either way, it wasn't really working. So what I did was when I came into MVivo and I was looking at the nodes, I noticed that references is the terminology that was used to refer to all the quotes that I've pulled out. So for example, if I open up uh, the lack of preparation node, then all of these highlighted yellow bits are the quotes that I pulled out of the interview PDFs into this node. So I'm looking to extract um, or export all of this information so that I can look at it for each of my nodes to understand um, my data a little bit better. So I did notice that references is what they are referred to. So when I went to the NVivo help page, I searched under references and what I found was where it says export the references in a node here. So if I go down to that, it gives the instructions on what you want to do, but I'll show you what that looks like back in NVivo. So if I go under here, make sure my nodes are highlighted. If I go under share, then I can export the notes. So much like everything else in NVivo, it's going to export whatever is highlighted. So there are a few things that I want to show you before I show you the exporting. So one is that you can select multiple nodes, but only if they are on the same hierarchy level. So if I click Alumni Perceptions, if I hold down the Shift key, I can't click um, anything below it but I could highlight another parent node, which is faculty perceptions. So you see both of them are highlighted here. But those are just sort of my heading nodes, which um, for my organization's sake uh, made things a little bit easier for me. And there's no references in them, so obviously I don't want to export those. But if I click on the next level, then what I can do is I can use shift again to highlight more than one. But again, I can't go down to that lower level of node. So that's a little bit annoying, but I'll show you. I, you know, it's just going to take a couple different steps to do it then. So what I could do is go all the way to the bottom of all my nodes. And this way I've highlighted all of the nodes on this level that have references to them. So then I can go up to share and export. And what you want to do is say reference view. It comes as a Word document. You could change this to a PDF or something else if you wanted to, but I'm leaving it as a docx. Uh, the location it's going to. Um, I clicked on name and description so that way I can get as much of the data as possible. I did put annotations in some of my um, files, so I included annotations as well. And then you just click OK. I'm not going to click OK because I've already done this. I don't need to duplicate my data. Um, and then what I did was I went down to the next level again so highlighted all those at that next level um, and went through the same process to export. So what I end up with in my file is I have a separate Word document for each of 
the nodes. And if I open up one of these Word documents, then I have the quotes and where they came from. So I have a separate Word document that includes all of the references for each of my nodes that I was able to export them all pretty much in one one go it, it you know actually it, it was two rounds because of the different levels and depending on how much hierarchy you have you're going to have to go um, and do each hierarchy level but you can do all of the the nodes within that hierarchy level all at the same time now there was one option that was described here that says um, if you export a parent node with node aggregation it includes the content coded so I did try that so I went into alumni perceptions into the node properties I clicked on here where it says aggregate coding for children because I thought well maybe if I down if I do that so um, I'll show you if I click on that then we see references, all of these references that are under this alumni perceptions are all calculated here. When I did that, however, what I downloaded, what I ended up with is this list that has all the references, but they're just numbered and they don't tell me where they came from or which of those hierarchy nodes they are attached to so that wasn't actually going to be very useful to me so I don't know if this is the only way to download um, the references with the nodes or if it's the best way but uh, just again what it did give me was word documents with the references for each of my nodes and now I can look at those I can figure out what I want to do with them um, so that's it hopefully this uh, is helpful if um, you have any questions let me know